Habiba's a special elephant because she's only 13 years old and she's lost her mother and she's without an experienced adult to, to guide her through life. And as a result, she doesn't look like she's doing very well. And Frank's not just concerned for Habiba. Although Habiba's only 13 years old, which is about the same as uh, being a 13-year-old human in terms of life experience, she does have a little baby. And that means that the stakes are high, not just for her, but she's also got a dependent. And what would really help Habiba right now is if she could find uh, an, an elder, experienced female from another family to take her in and show her the ropes. Elephant herds are usually made up of family members. But in Samburu, some matriarchs are taking unrelated elephants under their wing. This behavior is helping orphans survive at a time when their families are being torn apart by ivory poaching. Joining a larger, more experienced group could offer Habiba's herd a vital lifeline. Frank reaches the location where Habiba was last seen. Sorry, girls. We got her. Morning, Habiba. It's one thing to see, you know, a group of elephants on the plain munching grass. It's another to, you know, it's Habiba with her particular history and the fact she's on her own in life and she's struggling with this little kid and it does give an extra tinge to this morning scene. Habiba's looking a little bit scrawny. The calf looks a little bit on the thin side too, but um, it's to be expected in this dryness. Habiba's calf is not the only one depending on her. Even though she's only a teenager, at 13, Habiba is the oldest in her herd. The younger orphans look to her for leadership, but she's half the age of a normal matriarch. It's such a tough thing to... There's so much responsibility on her shoulders now. I mean, you look at all these other elephants that are with her, they're relying on her, they're looking up to her, but she doesn't really know what she's doing. Most of the time she's staying within the safety of the reserve, and as long as she doesn't do anything too erratic, and the rains will be here soon, and everything should be rosy. Until the rains come, they'll have to try and make it on their own. With other herds scattered because of the drought, it's unlikely she will find an experienced family to join.